How can we tackle unequal access to food and improve health in our community? Good health is more than going to the doctor, taking medicine and using NHS services. It is integrated into every aspect of people's lives. We must consider good health not as a burden to be achieved, but as a goal that gives back and provides many benefits. Being able to access and eat food that is safe, nutritious and affordable is one way for people to stay healthy and well. Sadly, not everyone can get the food they need. There are many social and economic issues which affect people's access to food in a range of ways. What have we learned from the pandemic? The COVID-19 pandemic has shone a light onto unequal access to nutritious and affordable food in the east of England. We need a big shift in thinking to tackle this. Our research with local communities has highlighted the need to give more support to families on a low income and those worst affected by the pandemic. For example, health visitors must continue to prioritise checks on mothers' mental well-being to ensure they are getting the emotional support they need to feed their child. Local authorities and schools must continue to work across the community and help those unable to access food. Families eligible for free school meals must be able to access them and extra support is needed for people new to the scheme. As well as making sure people with health conditions eat well, we must not forget about the people who care for them, who also need our support. Older people sometimes experience isolation and will need help to get out and about and to keep cooking, eating and drinking enough. How can we achieve these things and accomplish more? It is important to champion co-production. This means working in partnership with local communities and organisations to improve access to nutritious and affordable food. Building trust so we can work together is essential. Who are the real influencers in your community? We need to value champions in our local communities and ask them what support they need, from help with allotments to setting up a charity. What would success look like in a community? Local people and services could help to design success criteria, because success means different things to different communities. To sum up, let's take a local approach and trust that our communities are the real experts. You know what you need, but may not have the means to achieve it. Collaborating with communities to design solutions is one way to reduce unequal access to nutritious food and achieve better health for everyone.